The Princess and the Pea by Hans Christian Andersen Once upon a time, there was a prince who wanted to marry a princess, but she had to be a real princess. So he traveled around the world to find one. There were a great many princesses, but he was never sure whether they truly were real princesses. There was always something not quite right about them. At last, he returned home very unhappy because he could not find what he was looking for. One evening, there was a terrible storm with thunder and lightning and rain pouring down in torrents. It was dreadful. Suddenly, there was a loud knocking at the castle door and the king hurried to open it. There on the doorstep was a princess, but what a sight! She was drenched. Water ran down from her hair and her clothes. It ran down into the tops of her shoes and out of the toes. Nevertheless, she insisted that she was a real princess. We will soon find out, thought the queen, eyeing the bedraggled girl. However, she said nothing and went to prepare a bedroom for the unexpected guest. She stripped all the bedding off and placed a pea on the base of the bed. Then she took 20 mattresses and laid them on the pea after which she then laid 20 eiderdown quilts on top of that. Then, the queen showed the princess where she had to spend the night and the girl climbed in thankfully. The next morning, the king and queen asked her how she had slept. Oh, terribly badly, she said. I hardly shut my eyes the whole night. Goodness knows what was in the bed. It was something very hard and now I am black and blue all over. By this answer, the queen knew she was a real princess. Only a princess would be sensitive enough to fill a pea through 20 mattresses and 20 eiderdown quilts. The prince at long last had found his real princess whom he married, and the pea was placed in the museum where it can still be seen today, if it has not been stolen. The end. Thank you for listening. Until next time. Bye!